Hello guys, we're going to be talking about mouse cursor highlight options for Windows 10. And in this video, I'm getting the point across that a lot of companies people work for these days have IT restrictions and don't allow third party installations for mouse highlight features, that kind of thing. And at the same time, there is a built-in feature for Windows. So Windows 10 has an, an add-on software, if you want to call it that, called Power Toys. And if you go to the website here, which I'll put a link in the YouTube video here, I hope, you'll see here that there is installing Power Toys. And there's a variety of ways to install it. Windows Package Manager, so on and so forth. A few more. There's these are the standard ways to install things, which you can follow this in the, in the links. And then there is the company. So my particular company, they have a um, feature called Company Portal. And when you open the Company Portal, you can do a search for Power Toys. And we have this, it's already installed, of course. Basically, you would install this. After I've installed it, I restarted the computer. I don't think you have to, but I did anyway. And once we start back up here, you'll have this preview right here under recently. You also have this right here. And when we double click this option right here, you see you have quite a few amazing new features built into Windows now. We're focusing on the most utilities. And right now, the defaults are relatively good. I haven't changed much other than the shortcut. Um, this enable find my mouse and you double click the control B key. You'll see here that we now have this right here, which is fantastic when you're doing videos. The Appearance of behavior can be modified for this feature here. Then you can exclude certain apps if you don't want to. Then we've got this mouse highlighter. So whenever I click on something, I get this uh, behavior here. I'm left clicking right now, which I've got set up for yellow and the opacity. And then if I right click, it's blue. Um, this is another fantastic thing. It fade in and out. I've modified these slightly. Um, and then there's a couple other things that you could use. Um, this is a fantastic feature and I just want everyone to be aware of it because when I first started using OBS Studio, which is what I'm recording this with, uh, I found it really difficult to find something better for my mouse. Hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe.